Hey, what's up guys? You boys, Farley 2K7, back for brand new Grand Theft 5 Firefighter Mod video. Today, we're back at the Grapeseed Fire Department. We had a lot of fun checking out the new freight line of fire trucks yesterday. If you guys missed that video, definitely go check that out. I will link it. But today, we are back. Yesterday, we ran as the engine, and today, we're going to be running the rescue. Ooh. A civilian shot in grave seat. All right, it sounds like EMS is taking that call. But like I said, guys, yesterday we ran the pumper, the engine. So if you guys want to check that out, definitely do so. And today we're going to be running the rescue. So on top we have the boat, just in case we have any water calls we have to respond to. Uh, we also have all of our equipment in the back. So any car accidents or wrecks or collapses or whatever could happen we're basically prepared to respond to so let's see another civilian shot oh my goodness what is going on today with all these people getting shot this is crazy guys all right it sounds like they're dispatching another uh, ambulance to it they're not sending us yet all right we're still today so let's see what happens All right, guys, we're getting a report of a, looks like a car accident. We're going to respond to that. Oh, I am on the rescue. I was about to jump onto the engine. All right, let's get our gear on. I'll just put the bunker pants for now. And let's get going. This looks like it's right around the corner, actually. Now we are responding with the engine as well since the rescue only has two people on it. Looks like we have one lady in the vehicle. I'm just gonna go ahead and block off traffic. Let's get EM, I mean, uh, police here as well for traffic control. All right, guys, so the sheriff department is here. Let's take a look and see what we're working with. Uh, looks like the back of our car got rear ended really bad. All right, Let's see if this door is gonna open up. Nope. This door is kind of stuck. All right, we're going to have to get the tool here and see if we get this open. We'll get the Jaws of Life. All right, guys, so we have the tool in use. Now, uh, we don't really have, like, a model uh, Jaws of Life. That would be cool, but we're just going to role play. So looks like she's she's completely knocked out, but we're going to try to get her out and see if we could... Uh, stabilize her breathing and bring her back here but yeah this wreck is looking crazy i wonder if it was a hit and run i don't even see yeah these two vehicles were here too but they don't have any damage so i'm guessing this was a hit and run guys damn that is crazy all right so it looks like they have her just about out all right perfect <laughs> I'm trying to pick her up. Oh my god, are you here? Right, apparently, I cannot pick her up. I'm picking up everybody except for her, so I'm just gonna put her right over there. Uh, let's see if we could work on her to EMS gets here. Alright, I'm feeling a pulse, breathing, doesn't seem like she's breathing, but I'm feeling a pulse. All 
All right, looks like she is coming back. We're still waiting on that ambulance to get here. We're gonna transfer her off to EMS, but she's looking much better. There we go. All right, she's looking good. We need to get her to the hospital though. Let's see where EMS is at. They should be pulling up any moment now. No, 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 no. Holy. Shoot. That's like a glitch I've been having lately with LSPDFR. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This was going so well. I was trying to make this as legit as I can. Oh, my God. All right. Well, let's see what EMS is going to do. I don't know how they're going to take her. Wait, who are they taking? I am so confused right now. All right, I'm just, I'm guessing they're still gonna transport her. I got your cover. Damn, that, that was crazy. I don't even know what to do right now. I'm just waiting to see what's gonna happen. Now she's gonna look at her like, oh, what happened to this lady here? After you just unloaded an AR-15 on her. Golly. Alright, I'm just want to see if she's going to pop back in once the paramedics get inside. Because normally they, she would follow them in, but since she's like kind of dead now, I wonder what's going to happen. I don't know what's happening, guys. Alright, looks like they're just going to leave without her. All right, let's try that one more time, huh? <laughs> so I'm gonna call for another ambulance. I just made it, I just copied her over, but let's try it. Oh, shoot. God damn, this is crazy. All right, they should take her this time. Um, I guess as far as this vehicle, we'll let the uh, police do what they gotta do, and I guess they could go ahead and get a tow truck for it. All right, so paramedics are gonna take her for real this time. It's just a mess, all of these cars. I'm just gonna delete all of these. All right, so they're gonna transport her. Uh, oh, tow truck's here, perfect. All right, so it looks like we are good to go, guys. That was our first call of the day. Let's head back towards the station, and we'll let dispatch know we are 10-8. All right, let's go. Just got toned out for another motor vehicle accident. This one is going to be on the Sonora, Sonora Freeway, heading towards uh, Polito Bay. So let's hop in the rescue truck, and let's get going.
All right, guys, it looks like we are on scene. There's going to be a two-vehicle motor vehicle accident here. All right, it looks like we have a two-vehicle accident here. We have one male in the silver car. And let's see what's going on with this green car. looks like it's kind of hard to see without being able to bend down. All right, looks like I have one person in this side as well. Let's see if we get them out. EMS is on the way. We have this lane shut down for traffic. You know what? I think we're just going to have to shut down this whole lane because we have our guys kind of working in both lanes right now. But this looks crazy, guys. So let's try to get everybody out. This guy's probably going to take a little bit more work. So I'm going to see if we could focus on this guy right now for, for now. All right, we gain entry. We got him out. So I had to reload the game uh, since the crash, but we're just going to try to continue. Looks like they got the guy out of the green vehicle as well. So I'm going to work on this guy. Still waiting for EMS to get on scene also. Okay, there we go. He's probably going to attack me. I don't know why, but it, like it always happens. So I'm just... <laughs> yep. See, he was just about to attack me, guys. So that... I'm one step ahead of you, buddy. All right, so they're going to take him. Let me unfreeze him. All right, they're going to transport him to Sandy Shores. Perfect. Let's take a look at this guy now. Okay, he has a pulse, but it is extremely low, guys. Let's see if we can bring him back. All right, two for two. We got them both up. Okay, so I'll get another ambulance for him as well. He's probably going to try to attack me. You asked for it. I don't know why it does that. Right, here's a second ambulance. I'll just make him follow me over here. All right, they got control of him. I was about to say, why are they both trying to get into the uh, passenger seat? Alright. Alright guys, so we are all done here. Uh, I guess we'll just get the tow trucks out here. I know normally like the police would do all their stuff, but you know, AI can't technically do it for themselves, so we just gonna have to do it for them. But it looks like we are clear. As soon as they get the uh, road opened up, we'll move the trucks and we'll go back into service. 
That's a pretty bad wreck. It doesn't look as bad as it did originally when we pulled up on scene since I had to like reload the game and everything. But like at first it was looking crazy. And here comes one of the flatbeds. The tow truck looks like it's coming from the other side. It's kind of stuck in traffic. Oh my god, what the heck happened over here? Wow. Alright. Well, looks like they're all good, so let's go ahead and hop in our trucks and let's clear the scene. Alright guys, so we are 10-8 and back in service. We're gonna have to spin around up here and head back towards Grape Seed. That was a pretty cool call though. Let me know if you guys did enjoy. We used um that was crazy callouts. So that was the first time that I was using crazy callouts for like a fire or EMS video, so. I thought it went pretty well. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comments section. All units, we've got an 11351 on um, CD Road. Alright, we got a report of a fire. Let's go ahead and respond to this one. Looks like it's right around the corner. It's been a pretty busy day for us. We've been running calls all day. Now, according to dispatch, they said somebody is trapped in the car, so that's why we responded with both trucks. It's a police car? What? Oh, shoot. Okay, I really hope the person got out. Oh, man. Oh, this thing's going to be spreading fast, actually. All right, let's get to work. Oh, I parked way too close. I parked the truck. Oh man, okay, okay. Oh man. Bad rig placement. Oh my god. <laughs> Shoot, I was not prepared for this. We we're messing up. I don't think I have a fire extinguisher easier either. Oh, we are so screwed right now, guys. This is not good. There's a fire extinguisher. Oh my god, it's so far away. <laughs> I should have went up. Oh, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Spray, dang it. Damn, we just got this fire truck yesterday. We can't lose it already. <laughs> I don't even know what's going on behind me. This is a failure. But we're leave leaving this in episode because this is hilarious. Put unlimited ammo on. Oh, thank God, the truck did not blow up. All right, that's fine. Freightliner trucks are apparently super tough. <laughs> All right, let's see what's happening over here now. This is crazy. Let me let me call for some backup actually, because my guys are all just sitting in the truck doing nothing. This fire is spreading out. I still don't even know if somebody's in the vehicle. We're gonna have to check and see. I wonder if it's a wait, maybe a prisoner got stuck in there. I don't even know. I really have no idea. Right, we have backup on scene. They're helping us put the fire out. Well, you know what I wanted to do too? I wanted to put on our scene lighting. Thank you guys for all everybody that left a comment on the video yesterday. I could not remember the word scene lighting to save my life. All right, this thing is broken, so it's not letting us get back in, but we'll just warp in and fix it. Damn, this scene is crazy, though. All right. Let me not drive it into the fire again. All 
right, I'm gonna also put the lights on this one. Since you guys are in here doing nothing, I'm just gonna pull y'all out. Put these on. Yeah, he's, they're gonna try to get in. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Give them some room. Okay, there we go. <laughs> the things I gotta do, man. The things I have to do. So this charger got burnt to a crisp, guys. I don't see anybody inside of it. There's no sheriff. I look like I got rear-ended or something. I don't know. I guess the sheriff's department's gonna have to do the investigation. Wait, CPR successful, the pet is alive? Wait, somebody was down? I am so confused right now. I have no idea what's going on, but hopefully you guys did enjoy the episode. Hopefully you enjoyed the fire trucks. I see that you guys really, I think like, I don't know. Let me look at my phone real quick. Like I posted the, the video yesterday. It's, I posted it four hours ago. So I'm recording this four hours after I posted the first video. And it has 397 likes and 69 comments already, which is crazy. Normally I don't get that many comments. And it has like... 8,000 views already so I see you guys really do enjoy these fire trucks I definitely will be using them some more as well as some other vehicles by medic 4523 as well yep so I just want to say guys wait Frankie Swift pet status civilian burned from fire so somebody really was trapped inside but maybe he like got out just in time and they were able to save him, I guess. But um, yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy and these fire trucks do look amazing. There's actually a couple more I haven't tried out yet. We, there's a KME engine, so maybe we'll install that one next and we'll do a couple of videos with that. And we also got to go back and do that York Regional ambulance too because we did the, like the fly car but we never did the ambulance so we're gonna definitely do that but if you guys enjoyed the episode please do me a favor just hit the like button it helps out so so much so if you could hit the like button and if you could leave a comment i would appreciate it so so much guys so thank you so much for watching really do hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you guys in the next one peace